Hi there, we're currently doing an astrological sign reading for the month of August 2018. Thank you so much for subscribing to this channel. I very much appreciate it. And the sign that we're doing is Libra. So I feel like really getting into fantasy, it's obvious that these cards are really jumping out at us. So we have a seven of pentacles, which usually has to do with decision making. And that, maybe that's why I was saying fantasy, because we want to be in a place where we're able to like catch our breath, become very intuitive, get rid of worry, get rid of all the things that are stopping us from really living our life to the fullest. So I'm feeling like we need to be more like children right now and just um, not making a big deal out of everything and just kind of having a little bit more fun all right fun and lightheartedness the fool is very much that way he um he lives his life by the seat of his pants and he's not afraid um he's looking ahead he's not looking back that sort of thing so if there's are any annoyances on your part you really kind of want to shake that off right now because yes it may be the case like yes this is annoying but like look at the positive in your life right now Oh, very interesting energy. So it's, I got the fairies clever, fairies bright, from garden, wood, and pond, guide my thoughts, guide my sight, please help me find the answers on a path that's true and right. I have a fairy greeting here. So I'm feeling like just that lighthearted laughter energy. I'm hearing namaste, bitches. We're just kind of like coming in and just being really charismatic, but still very kind. All right. So we're we're um, drawing negative attention away from our body. So we're doing grounding exercises. So we really have to um, let go of our ego, release fears this month especially in the beginning of the month. And then we have 10 of wands. This is saying that there is a bit too much weight on your shoulders at this moment. Lots of distractions, lots of stuff going on. And we want to put everything to the wayside for now and, and not um, hearing agree to disagree. Like we're not going to hang out in that energy anymore. Um, but, oh my gosh, and hearing ball soup. So um, it's when we need to laugh. Like you cannot not laugh right now. And that's definitely going into the second week as well. So we do have some intense energy. It's eclipse season. So just be mindful of that. I think it's August 11th. We have a solar eclipse. And then I have the exact same card saying the exact same thing. So finding a path that's true and right for me. Um, you matter most in your life. And I feel like just expressing that again into the third week, you're going to be finding there's resistance, there's temptation, all this stuff. So it's like, should I, shouldn't I? And the answer is probably going to be yes, if it serves you at this moment in time. Otherwise, no, put it aside. And so really, that's probably why the decision making was coming up, because you want to make sure that it's creative, you want to make sure it's it you are taking risks, and that it's going to bring you rewards. So um, it's not a time to be like working too hard. All right. Um, you will get a little kind of caught up in funky energy if you are. Ace of Swords. This is for the end of the month and everybody is having such interesting cards around the last month for each sign. And so this is really about moving forward, looking at your life in terms of what have I gained, not what have I lost. Um, a laughter and just hearing, hi to kids, hi to wife. So just letting go of um, things if it's too much for you right now, meaning like maybe you have a goal that you set for yourself, but because it's taking so much time, you're changing that goal. That's completely okay. So you have to give yourself permission to relax and let go. I was even feeling that way before I came on here for this reading, that these temptations and these disagreements, that sort of thing, are all setting you up for success. But what you have to focus on, if you want to focus on, I should say, is really getting a hold of like yourself and saying, is this going to give me what I want? because you matter most, okay? So I hope that you enjoyed this reading. I hope you have an awesome August and you can go into robinsealing.com if you'd like to contact me that way. I think I said thank you so much for subscribing and I very much appreciate it. Namaste, bye.